Oh, that helped, didn't it? Well done. Watch the ghost come now and get me. <gasps> I kid, I kid, I kid, I kid, I kid. <laughs> David Clark, where are you? Come speak to me. Right here. Welcome back to Rookie Ones. Playing a cool game, we're playing Phasmobia. Usually we're playing with the boys, but the boys aren't available at the minute because of all the work and stuff. But let's jump in. It's had a few new updates. I'm really, really interested to see some of them because I am a ghost hunter. I have missed ghost hunting so much. What a perfect way to do it. So uh, let's jump straight, straight, blah, 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 blah. pop my teeth in, and we'll do a little bit of ghost hunting, shall we? Now, I've had a lot of questions about my knife too. I had it for Christmas. I had to tighten it slightly. It's a bit tight now. But how cool is this? My butterfly knife. Amazing. Wicked from uh, Amazon. Let's jump in the game. We're playing Phasmobia. I have no... I've, I've played it quite a few times and I'm really excited because I've had a load of updates. Like I said, I've been a ghost hunting, so... It's loads of different things. I know the video camera's changed and there's a nightmare, a nightmare mode. And I think there's cursed items now, which is really cool. So we're just going to jump straight into it. We have no idea. I don't actually know where the hell I want to go to because there's a few new ones now. There's the farmhouse, which I think is new anyway. The asylum's old, but they've got a Maple Lodge campsite. Edgefield Street House. I think we should go to the street house. That's an amateur. I'm going to do amateur mode because it's been a while, but I know I'm a, I'm a professional, like I am. Like the professional. Ready up. And let's start then. Do I start? Let's go. Let's get in there, Dippy ones. Let's freaking do this. My headphones broke, if anyone who wants to know, but I'm recording because for some reason my mic won't work. It's broken, it's in the corner, so I'm using my normal camera and my kitty headphones to record this, which is a nightmare. Okie dokie. Okay, we're going to check the whiteboard, we're going to turn the volume up. There's been no reports of any sightings or nothing, so my objective is discover what type of ghost you're dealing with, have a member of your team witness, well I haven't got any teams, so that helps me a lot, have a member of your team witness ghost event, get a ghost to blow out a candle, which I didn't bring up a fucking candle, because I didn't think I needed one, cleanse the area with a ghost using a smudge stick, which again, I didn't get a smudge stick, so, is it J to open my book? J is to open my book, because this is all changed now, there's a load more ghosts, and apparently some ghosts are really nasty too, so I need the key, so I need the key, I want... A strong flashlight. That's a UEV light, don't want that. What's that? What's to put down? Is it yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, so F's to put down. Is that my strong flashlight? Let's have you. I want you. I know that I've got a dot camera or something. I can get one of these as like a dot thing. Let's have a thermometer. Oh, did I not bring a K2? I bought a K2, that's fine. Uh, let's just go in with these in a minute. We'll go in with these and we'll see what's going on. What was the uh, ghost's name? I got some sanity pills too, haven't I? Yeah, I got sanity pills. What was the ghost's name? The ghost's name is Joseph Martinez. This is a ghost also be response to people who are alone. You should be able to... See, that's changed a lot. Before that was just normal. It used to annoy me when I when they were playing the game. I was like, because it didn't look right. So my torch is on. Let's go inside there, Joseph Martinez. Okay, so we're in the house. This looks really cool. I've already got a door opening. So I know I have to hide, so I'm going to try and find some hiding spots for this. So I know there's a cupboard. Is there a cupboard down here somewhere I can hide? Okay. I think that was my breath. Uh, okay. Thermometer. See if I can find some cold temperatures first. I'm quite terrified. I used to go to it all the time, but this is terrifying sometimes. So i got a back door just in case. I need to get the fuck out of here. Let's have a look around. What have I got? Nice dinner table. I've got like a... This... Someone's opened me lead. Someone's opened me cupboards. What's in here then? I have actually think now we have a run button now too. This is 20... Fuck! That wasn't very nice. We're dealing with a demon. That's new. Oh, I did not like that at all. So, what are we thinking? Let's go downstairs. Why would we not go downstairs, eh? Why would we not go down here? I'm looking for, at the minute, a cold room. Is anywhere cold? I'll just turn my torch off. Is there a way to turn my torch off? Yeah, it's T. 
T. Joseph Martinez, are you here? God, I hear footsteps already. Let's just find the call room, see if we can find a call room. That was terrifying, straight away. Oof, hello. Uh, wh which way is out? Okay, let's go. This is the living room, 18 degrees in the living room. The one thing I used to like about this game is uh, you can. Oh, I'm gonna open these closets just in case. I have to hide. Just in case. I've learned one thing from playing with my mates. Open the cupboards. Okay, we got a lot of rooms to discover. This is 14 degrees. We have a 14 degree room. Bathroom is. Oh, bathroom's nine. Bathroom was nine, I think. Or is it this bedroom that was nine? The bedroom's nine degrees. Bedroom was nine degrees. The bedroom is nine. This could be this could be the hot spot. Joseph Martinez, are you here? Joseph, are you here? Joseph Martinez, are you here? So I might have a room because these are eleven degrees. Eleven degrees, thirteens. Let's go in this room. Nine. This is a nine two. This is a ten. What about this bathroom? Elevens. I'm guessing it could be those two rooms. Maybe. I can't get out of this room. I'm stuck in here. Great. Fantastic. Can I get out? Joseph Martinez, are you here with me today? Give me a sign. You crazy bastard. There's a lot of rooms up here, isn't there? Kids room. That teddy bear moves, I'm going to shit myself. So we have a choice. Let's open these cupboards just in case. Give me a bit of guitar. This is a 9.4, 8.0, It's not a hallway, is it? Is it this room? I don't know freezing temps. Joseph Martinez, are you there? Joseph Martinez. Joseph Martinez. Give me a sign. Apart from the spirit box, I'm going to try the K2 because I might have the two rooms it might be. Let's get the EMF or electromagnetic, electric and magnetic frequencies. Let's see if we can see anything on this bad boy. Let's put him in here first. Nice little setup. There's a Ouija board. No, it's not a Ouija board at all. It's a bloody whatever that is. Oh, I don't think I went in here. Oh, yeah, I did. I went to this bathroom, did No, I didn't go in this room. Let's try this room. Come on, give me a sign. Joseph Martinez, are you here? Stop hiding from me. Joseph Martinez. Joseph Martinez, are you in the garage? Are you in here? Can you give me a sign? Make a noise. Make a noise, Joseph Martinez. Uh, stop, stop hiding from me. What the hell? I got, something's turned on. Something's happened. What's that noise? Is that the bathroom? What's happened? What's happened? Oh, hello. What's that noise? It's not like water running. Something's been turned on then, is it? How do I use the Ouija board? Uh, it's closed. No, I'm going to leave that open actually. I don't know. Shut that. Shut that. I'm trying to use the Ouija board at the minute. Nope. Can I use the Ouija board at all? Put you up there. How do I pick up the Ouija That's how you pick up the Ouija board. Whoa, what was that? Remember? Remember where I put that? I'm guessing there's water running in the bathroom. Ah ha ha ha! See, I think I should document that, don't I? Let me go get my camera. Not camera. Shit! 
Super loud. So did I not win? <laughs> I didn't win. I don't think I won. Welcome back. Total difficulty. Did I get money for that? I got actually money for that. Okay. I got money for that. I don't know how I got money for that, but I got money for it. I think did I lose a few things? Okay, I'm gonna change to I'm not gonna go prison, I'm gonna go somewhere really easy. Will Street. Set up your time. It's ready, easy. That's all I gotta do. It's just go. I can go and do it. Done. Ghost names. Oh, I thought that said David Chick. Then I was gonna go. No way. David Clark. Oh, David Clark. This house looks tiny. At least, at least I should be able to get this one. At least I should be able to get this one. At least. Let's turn that up slightly because I can't hear that well. David Clark. Welcome to my house. This torch is shite. David Clark, are you here? Let's open these doors. I don't think there's an upstairs, which is good, because I don't really want an upstairs. Well, I witnessed the poltergeist, I witnessed the event. Are you taking me into this room? Oh yes, come on then. I've got an EMF of two. EMF of two. EMF of two. Oh shit, now why is it always a creepy basement? Oh, there's a lot of rooms down here. An EMF or two. I'm guessing it might be that bathroom then. I literally got a goose pimples. Hello. Hello. Yeah, we're good. We're, good. We're not gonna die. We're not gonna die. How the hell do I get out of here? Yeah. I should play nightmare mode. Apparently, nightmare mode is really good, but I probably won't survive it like two minutes on the nightmare mode. So, we might have the room. This is the garage. Something fell, I heard something drop. The only place I've got so far is this bathroom. This is the only place. Oh, it was. Not anymore. For you, Scooby Doo. Oh, that one's ticked off. I haven't got a capture. I can capture a ghost. Discover what type of ghost it is. David Clark, the ghost in response to everything. You're able to then anger. You should be able to use its name to anger and get some paranormal activity. Make sure you refer to journal and write down your evidence you found. I haven't found any. Oh, no, I haven't found any evidence yet, have I? Let's take the ghost book. Let's see if I get it to write in a ghost book. It could be one. You might be able to write in a ghost book for us. I only really found out where the bathroom is, and I haven't got a thermometer, which is bad. I hear a noise. David Clark, are you upstairs? Are you in this back bedroom? I've also noticed there's nowhere to hide. David Clark, are you in the back room? I ain't going right downstairs, but I have to go downstairs for the video. Are you in the back room? Use the sign. Didn't I find a Ouija board? Was that my last game? That was my last game, wasn't it? Ouija board. David Clark? There's no electric. Fantastic. David Clark, you in this room? Give us a sign. I feel like I'm on a real normal ghost hunt. This is what we're like on real ghost hunts. Trying to make noises and trying to make sounds and trying to listen out for real things. David Clark, I'm coming back upstairs. Is this showing you like? Oh. Bathroom? Nope. David Clark, where are you? David. Make my lights flash again, please. Make my lights flash. Move the teddy bear. Yeah, boring old fart. David. David, you're not being very friendly, Ghost. Are you a Casper? 
Are you Casper? Are you not as scared to go as I told you? I should have bought my camera with a tripod and see if I can get any orbs. Shall I see if I can get any orbs? Not a bad call, eh? Not a bad call. Not a bad shout. Let's see if I have a camera. Which I do. What is this thing? I don't really know what that is. Is it a motion sensor? Not a bad call. Let's have a motion sensor. Let's take the camera. Motion sensor. So cool the way they've done that. It's really, really cool. David Clark, I'm coming in the house. I'm going to put this camera... I'm going to put it on the table, facing outwards. Is that the right way? Uh, that way. Okay, is that on? How do I know if it's on? Let's go night vision. Put it down. I'm guessing that's now on. Also, I've got this, which I'm guessing it is a... Oh, a laser grid. Hello. Let's see if that works then. Let's see if that's working. So I've got to roughly know where the area is. Got any orbs? I see something come flying around the screen now. Yeah, I don't think the place is haunted. <gasps> David Clark, where are you? I saw you in the bathtub. Speak to me, David Clark. The power of Christ compels you. Talk to me. Do you need me to be alert? What? Okay, now things are kicking off. David Clark, where are you? I saw you. That was a really cool little feature, the thing I saw then. I shit myself slightly. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Shit myself slightly there. <laughs> I saw like this light bomb past the thing. Did I actually get anything then? Did my uh, EMF say old? I think it might have said old. I didn't hear I might have heard it, I don't know. Because I got cursed items now, cursed possessions, haunted mirrors, evidence. I think I got fingerprints. No, I haven't got any fingerprints. Uh, I'm gonna go try it. I don't think I heard the spirit box. I definitely saw the dots projections, I think. If that one night, you saw the projection go past the thing. So it's not, I haven't got EMF 5, it can't be ghostwriting. And I haven't got a thing for freezing temperatures. So I'm gonna, if it doesn't work, capture a picture of the ghost. I could have had a picture of that ghost too then, really annoying. David Clark, can I have your photo please? David Clark, can I have a photo of you? David Clark, a photo. David Clark, can I have a photo of you, please, in the bathroom? You're in the bathtub, is that alright? So it's definitely this bathtub, back room, I think. Because I can't remember where the hell I put my uh, my uh, EMF. Don't leave it downstairs. David Clark, where are you? Oh, there's a thing on the floor. Take a picture of that. Might be evidence. What's this? Laptop, laptop, camera. David Clark, where are you? I could put the camera in the bathroom, maybe. Come with me, camera. Shit. Uh, put you down a minute. Uh, bring you. David Clark, where are you? Whoa. Needs to get the heebie jeebies. Uh, let's put it. I don't really know actually. I might put it here. Can I put it on the radiator? Yeah, I can put it on the radiator. Let's have it there. Oh, that helped, didn't it? Well done. Watch the ghost come now and get me. <gasps> I kid, I kid, I kid, I kid, I kid. <laughs> I kid, just let me pick my bloody camera up. How do I put things down? Oh, there's dew in my head in. I'm not afraid of you. I have a camera. 
David Clark, talk to me, where are you? Where's my fucking camera gone? I lost my camera. Okay, I've got my camera. I'm going to put it here. Okay. David Clark, if you're here, make a noise. Come on, I'm not afraid of you. I am not afraid of you. I want to see you. I want to see you. I ain't afraid of no ghost. I ain't afraid of you. I have a tiny bit. Shut that door. David Clark, where are you? Come speak to me. Uh, let's put shit. Let's put you uh, up here. Let's put it here. God, I, I was a paranormal investigator. I did these things for a living. What a nice man. What a lovely person. <laughs> I told you to come at the end and you get me, didn't I? I told you at the end you'd come and get me. I told you. Ah, Divicky Ones, I'm going to leave it there. But if you enjoyed that episode like I did, it was, it was truly terrifying. There's a few bits in there where I don't even know if I could even do that in real life. Literally, to hear that voice in your head, in your ear, it goes... Whoosh. And they've changed the filter now where you can just see through them, so they're like really thin, and I love that little detail. And the way they can see the projection come from the uh, the light dots now, which is brilliant, I love that. But I reckon I would have got it. I think it was probably a Wraith, but I don't know. Anyway, if you want to subscribe to the channel, hit that like button, and I'll see you on the next one, guys. Peace out, guys. Bye-bye.